Hello, Sydney. Is your favorite killer is back, and today we're continuing Man Eater. So I level up. I leveled up to level nice twenty. So now new quest appeared: fight Skelly So we're gonna do it. Well, I also unlocked this. And we can also upgrade it. Whoa. The tire four. Sweet. Okay, where's the quest? Okay. Perfect. Oh, just a sec. Swimming at a waste disposal site heightens your risk of a shark attack. Not to mention all varieties of diarrheal illnesses. Damn it. Oh yeah. Oh, you gotta be shitting me. Okay, let's see. Back on board the Cajun Queen. That's Kyle. My son, he's just here for the summer. Studies marine biology. <laughs> Look at that. I got one hand can still tie a hook. He got two can barely tie his shoes. <laughs> Must get that from his mama. Yeah. He used to have my daddy around. Spent a lot of time together. But we wasn't close. He was a shark hunter. That's all he was. If anybody were gonna catch the mega, it'd be him. <laughs> Thought it was a government experiment, got himself loose. Boy, he wanted that shark. Wanted it bad. Found it once. Didn't catch it, no. What... what happened to your father? What happened? Look, uh, I ain't got time to answer questions all day. Got work to do. Okay. Just like Kyle LeBlanc, our young bull is the inheritor of a long family tradition, struggling to find her place in the world. Episode 4, perfect. We are fortunate that the magic of the camera allows us to witness this savage orgy of feet with such vividness and detail. Perfect.
shores was built Perfect. on an elevated coastal hazard area. And while they don't have any disaster prevention strategy in place, I'm sure it'll be fine. Bracelet alarms fills the air as shark hunters leave Hunters. their homes to track our bull shark. Frontier between them and local farm. It's remarkable how quickly Port Clovis picks up arms in the name of a murderous cause. Uh, okay, what I wanted to do is go. Come to this guy. Level 3, I'm here, level 3. You see it? Let's show this shop what the Coast Guard's all about. Then we'll go to the store. Savage Shrimper, Pookie Paul. That's no dolphin. his best efforts, the aquatic beast refuses to be tamed. Eco-friendly. Okay, now we're just going to I mean, continue our quest. So what is better here? Protein? 
things. Oh yeah, I have to be. Okay, never mind. With little fanfare, another bounty hunt comes to a close. It's here in the grotto that the shark can discover the absolute serenity deep within her soul. Level oh, 21. Sweet. Okay, now, should I replace this? With this? No. But I finally find found this grow. Okay, we have three new quests. Oh fuck. Humans, mm, no problem. It takes three hours of training and eight dollars to become a licensed shark hunter. Killing beautiful animals for tasteless nutritious yeah. body parts than a four hundred and fifty dollar round of golf. Next quest. Let's go this way, it's faster. Could be looking right at me. Whether Poodle Wheat and Terrier mix should be called a Woodle or a Wheat. Oh, wait, that wasn't Quest. Shit. Where's the 
target. Okay, Everyone easy. Import this Mako from Sri Lanka and train it to guard their community? Not like that. Oh, but let's pretend they did, as it makes for a more interesting storyline. <laughs> and another one. Okay, maybe this way will be faster. The bull retreats to the grotto for refuge and quiet reflection. It's a kingfish in the mood, quite like watching a 73-year-old in a double bogey. The fact that they've turned the waters off Baton Tordu into a spawning ground attests to their love of seniors golf.
Even for sharks, it's important to create personal time for sober self-reflection. And this guy is astonishing. ancient sailors long to recognize that certain ocean creatures meant them harm. Chief among these was the shark. Make war not love, nice, sweet, cool, hot, sexy. Sultan of Speed, the Mako. Very, very nice. The Mako is known as the peregrine falcon of sharks. But as the peregrine is a land-based bird, this designation means nothing to the Mako. But I see two more quests here, so it's time to return to the first area. Once more, the shark turns back to this place of centered calm.
Let's stick to the shadow. The Fawtick Bayou area has lost 63 acres of marshland due to saltwater intrusion. Catfish, too easy. Nailed it. One more at the middle. The Bayou Brawl. The American Alligator.
decades, Rosie has been a star in Big B's Bayou Buddy stunt show. But our shark is far too young to appreciate Rosie's classic brand of celebrity. This can be interesting. Oh yeah. I always forgot I'm not in the game. The shark okay, there's a new the quest here. To focus on personal oh, wait, that was enough. So let's upgrade this shit because I'll definitely use it later. But I'll need to collect. things aren't upgraded. Never mind. Let's go. Back aboard the Cajun Queen, family tensions are at an all-time high. Kyle, what's wrong? Can you catch no reef? I can, but this one's like 20 feet. 15. Whatever. Can't do it. I'll come out there. I'll do it. The old man with one hand. Yeah, well, maybe you shouldn't be mutilating baby sharks. What are you saying? Nothing. Couldn't catch in the diaper. He telling me how to honor Shaw. Believe that? I mean, I came down here thinking it'd be a good opportunity for some father-son bonding. But now, I don't know. I might start looking for another summer job. Hey, not everybody made to be a fisherman. I just hope this whole university thing works out for him, yeah? Greeting the red tide has become an annual tradition in Port Clovis. Okay, I'm gonna end Every this part here, so I'm gonna see us soon.